Right, Keegan, all of that money is going to go to testing and actually removing the lead-based paint from homes here in the city of Jackson. Now, the main focus for this project is low-income houses that were built before 1978. So far, project leaders say they've tested about 70 houses. 30 have come back with lead hazards. The area of most concern is in West Jackson near the zoo. 100% of homes there tested back lead positive. This is especially alarming for homes with small children. A very interesting fact about lead-based paint is it's sweet. So that is why we target households with children in the home under the age of six because they will chew on the paint because it is sweet. They will snack on it like it's a snack. We ask that you, you acknowledge that, that level of concern and that you communicate with the city so that we can provide any measures to remediate that problem and make certain that we have healthy citizens. Now, if you're worried your home might be at risk, you can contact the City of Jackson Planning Department at 601-960-2155. The city will come out, test your home, and make the proper repairs if needed. They'll also be able to refer you or your family members to a doctor if you have been exposed to lead. For now, live in Jackson, Ann Parker 16, WAPT News.